tried. We really did. But we can't afford to do this anymore. You need money. Mm-hmm. Right. Pow-wow, upstairs, now-wow. <laughs> I will find you means if it's the last thing I do. OK, they're gone. So they want us to stay now? Yeah. No, I know. I don't understand them either. But they're not going to be our problem soon. We can find an unhaunted house to live in. But let's not get ahead of ourselves, yeah? Yeah, no, we should wait till it's official before we start looking at houses. Sorry I'm late. Oh, I remember you guys. Yeah. Wow, your budget's changed. Oh, well, my great auntie died. I'm really sorry to hear that. No, it's fine, I never met her. Right. I mean, the frontage really sells this place. So impressive. It was renovated by an architect who lived there first, I believe, in the 60s. Let's take a look inside, shall we? No. Sorry? No. I'm just not really feeling this one. Sure you don't want to see inside? No. She's very instinctive. Uh, goes with her gut. Put the house on wheels or a cart, move it to pastures new, then the hair lady can build the hotel in its place and ours the house forever will be. OK. Well, it's not OK, is it? You can't put a house on wheels. No, 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 no. It all comes down to money, right? So if they can find their own investors... We no want hotels. With respect, Robin, hear me out. It doesn't have to be a hotel if there are Investors. It's very clever, you see. You tell them they've invested in offshore high yields, all right? And then the profits they receive are just funds from other investors and so on and so forth. Sounds a bit like fraud, mate. Well, yes, sure, Pat. But, you know, sometimes you have to bend the rules in order to make them, uh, make you some money, so... Hmm. Oh, we sell cakes. We can't make cakes. Buns, then. That's not the issue, Kitty. Oh! I have it. I shall ghostwrite a novel. In Alison's name, a modern bestseller, the most erotic fiction of the year. Uh, oh, no. Michelle was driving a car. Oh, good Lord. Nathaniel was sitting handsomely in the adjoining seat. He leans over and kisses her nape. Be careful, she warns breathlessly. I'm trying to drive a car. Yes. Someone take this down. Quick, 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 quick. quick. Uh, drive car. Uh, Faniel, look nice in next chair. Eat up and then it do it. I'd buy that. Where was I? Nathaniel <gasps> caresses her. OK, so here we are. The penthouse. Nice to be up high. Away from it all. Indeed. OK, then. The first thing I'm going to show you, cos let's face it, that's why we're up here. The view. <laughs> You've got to be joking. I know. Stunning, isn't it? And a balcony What's there, if you're into gardening. Yeah. And, you know, even if you don't, you could barbecue there. And it's hello. south facing, so, you know, when the sun's out. Hello. Oh, oh, hello. 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 I just remembered I don't like heights. Well, uh, I thought you. It's not for me, thanks. Come to work, come to work. 